Hey everybody and welcome back to another lecture with Coding with Roby. In this lecture, we're going to learn how we can add our own status code to the response of an API. So for example, within our app.post, when this is successfully creates a new book, we get a status code of 200, which means OK. However, a status code of 201 is actually a successful response that also means something was created. So how we can do this is if we scroll all the way back up to the top, and right after request, we type in status for our new import. We can now scroll back down to our app.post. And right after the URL, let's pass in another parameter of status code equals status dot HTTP 201 created. Let's now save the file and make sure your application is running. I'm going to open up our browser and I'm going to refresh the page. Here, if we now go to create a book, and we just can use all the default values that we've set already, and we say execute, we're now going to get the exact same successful API request and response, but also a status code of 201, which means something was created successfully. This wraps up our lecture on how to create our own status code responses with a successful API. And I will see you in the next video.